counting had barely begun, but it was clear on Conservative faces that this contest would be conceded. Quite literally, nail-biting. And from the candidate himself, on arrival at the count in Nottingham, a shrug and a hug as the reality of this result was realised. The Clare Margaret Ward is duly elected. This result confounds a terrible set of local elections for the Conservatives. Council after council falling from their grip. If you don't know the name yet, worth remembering it. Claire Ward. As Mayor, I will work across the political divides, uniting those who share an ambition to make this place better so we can deliver truly transformational change for our region. For years, Ben Bradley has wanted the East Midlands to have a Metro Mayor, but in the end, it was the East Midlands that didn't want it to be him. This is a huge responsibility, it's a huge opportunity for our region, it's a chance to deliver more, and you rightly say, this investment, these powers, and this opportunity to do more for our region across the board uh, is a really important one, so uh, I trust that you will uh, give your absolute best in doing that. But turnout was low, only 27% of eligible voters, with some in Clifton today not impressed. Did you vote for the East Midlands Mayor yesterday? No, I'll be honest with you, no. I'm a feminist, so I make sure I do, even if I don't particularly agree with some people. I didn't vote as you well. Did, you didn't vote? Yeah, yeah. Any reason why? Uh, I don't like. <laughs> I don't like voting. I did not vote yesterday. Why was the, that? For the simple reason I don't agree with the Nottingham and Derby being put together. Those in charge know they've got their work cut out to convince some of the public. The mayor's got a number of uh, powers and a number of funding streams, so they're to do with housing, they're to do with transport, to do with net zero, to do with business growth, to do with jobs and employment. So they will be able to boost all of those areas with the funding that they're getting from Westminster. Isn't this just another layer of politics and politicians? So everybody says that. No, it isn't. What it is, is the means of drawing that money and powers down from Westminster. Without this regional body, that would not be happening. The new combined county authority will now officially get to work on Tuesday, with Labour at the helm and millions of pounds to spend. Lewis Warner, ITV News.